The last example that I have for you guys today is sort of a whole class model that doesn't actually utilize station rotation, but it does have choice. Um, so I just kind of wanted to show this to you because it's sort of a simplified version. So when we started class this day, we took attendance. Students worked as a group on um, going over their homework a little bit and then checking their answers. They also filled in a form together. We learned a new concept, detras. Well, this wasn't a new concept, detras day, but students tended to think that it was detras day, one word, when it was detras day. Regardless, then students opened up their city's packet that they had been working on for a few class periods. Um, I gave them an audio piece and they had a listening piece and they all did that at the same time. And then all students had an online formative quiz. These quizzes are, they give the students rapid feedback. They give me rapid feedback as well so that I know, hey, as we're about to break up into some options after having been together for the entire class, I now know who I need to pull up to talk to so that we could get a little bit of um, reteaching going on. So that way I had quick feedback and then very shortly after we had a choice. So students could have retaken a boot quiz that they had done a little bit earlier. Uh, they could have worked on a study guide for finals. They also could have started doing um, telling time because I felt like that was a little bit of a weak concept. They could have worked on writing with phrases of frequency, which was also something they were working on. Or lastly, they could have done some many online practices for the final. Um, and in this particular case, since we were getting to the end of the year, um, I was working with kids individually, but I didn't have a specific station. So I let them know verbally, if you didn't want to do any of those steps, you could have come up and talked to me at that point too. So this is sort of a simplified version, but it was a version that in which they used a lot of technology during class, which allowed me to flex the second half of class and let them do many different choices. So that is my Spanish one example. That is sort of a whole class blended learning, if you will.